there are superheroes among us. You see them at the grocery store or in the post office. Your neighbor or co-worker might even be a superhero. Hi, I'm Mark Lawrence from the Sunbury Broadcasting Corporation and a supporter of Susquehanna Valley Casa, Voices for Children. They are court-appointed special advocates who serve as a voice for children in the foster care system. Every child deserves a loving, nurturing, and permanent home in our community. Many children don't have that opportunity. CASA assists abused, neglected, and abandoned children whose cases are in the court system. Through no fault of their own, these children end up in foster care, often struggling in school, feeling helpless, and even more traumatized when they first enter the system. CASA advocates serve as the voice for these children, helping them establish a safe and permanent and loving home. Our professionally trained volunteers address the needs of these children on a one-to-one -one basis, creating a lasting relationship built on trust and kindness. It's our volunteers who give these children a greater chance at having a happy home and a carefree childhood. We like to call our volunteers plain-clothed superheroes. During the next few minutes, you'll learn firsthand what CASA volunteers and advocates are doing to help local children. It's an important cause and we need your help. I encourage you to be a part of changing children's lives by becoming a part of this important organization. She was 11 weeks old and she was a failure to thrive living with another foster home and her birth mother and I guess it just wasn't really working out well so she came into her home and just started to just thrive right away. We just really worked with her. I, since I stayed home, I was able to just be with her all the time and work with her and um, it was just just amazing. She just became a part of our, our family. I wasn't really familiar with what Acasa was, but um, when I first met her, she was just very kind and kind of almost gives you like a sense of relief that there's somebody that's there for this baby that you you know just got and they're just so helpless and um, she just gave us yeah just the you know feeling of relief and she was just so nice and you could tell that everything she was doing was just you know for this baby. I'm just very very appreciative that the CASA program found me because uh, my life is so much better because of it, because of the relationships and the friends I've made along the way. Having a CASA in the courtroom is critical. Um, first of all, they have the time um, and the passion when it comes to the children. Not that our guardian ad litems um, and the attorneys who are involved don't, they just don't have the same time. Um, generally, a CASA is assigned to one child or one family, so they can dedicate a lot of time. CASAs um, have the ability to dig deep into things that um, the other people in the courtroom may not. So when I have a child that has a CASA, I know so much more about that child and that family than I do the children who don't have a CASA. So to me, that's, that's a critical component of it. A lot of these children don't have those connections, those aunts, uncles, family, the, the go-to people to talk to about their problems. As they go through our system, the judges go away, the attorneys go away, in most cases, not all, but the caseworkers go away. The one constant that can always be there is the CASA volunteer because they form that connection and that bond. The stories that you hear from the volunteers that work with the children, just going into their homes and connecting these children with parents that they have never even met, or uh, finding a foster placement that they can stay with for the rest of their lives and become uh, good citizens. Uh, the stories are unbelievable and, and it truly touches my heart when I hear them. 
relatively new legislation has been passed about reporting for child abuse and that has increased the need and demand for our services because more and more children are being reported in the system. So the courts are being flooded with, as our caseworkers in social service agencies outside of ours, run by the county, and it really has created the demand. So this demand has increased the flow of kids into the system. It's also demanded that we use our resources to the best of our ability. So if you want to get involved personally, as a volunteer, that is absolutely a rewarding experience just for you as well as for the child. The outcome is a healthy, contributing child to our system and our future. In order to become a volunteer, you would go through a training, 40-hour training session, uh, would have to have the clearances, and after that we, we try to find a match that best would fit uh, for the volunteer and the child. After that, it is periodically meeting with the child, those interested and involved in the, in the child's life, and making reports to the court so that the court is able to make the best decision possible to give the child every chance to find, as I mentioned, the uh, stable, loving, permanent family that every child deserves. You know, if at this point in your life you're saying, well, you know, I've got my own family to raise, or I've got a full-time job, and I really don't have the time commitment, then I would encourage you, as we did when we were in that situation, to, to consider donating to CASA. Uh, we donated for, I would say, 25 years mm -hmm. before we actually became volunteers. And, uh, you know, there's, there's way more kids in the system that need a CASA that, than have a CASA right now. The need now. is great. The need is, yeah, really, really great. Well said. Um, and when you donate, you help with things like training programs and uh, outreach and that sort of stuff. The stories you've heard here today are just a few of the situations where CASA has made an impact. Thousands of children in our valley have benefited from a CASA volunteer. They served as the child's only voice, giving judges first-hand information about each child. There are many more children in the Susquehanna Valley waiting for the support of a person just like you. With your help, we can continue to provide these important resources to change the lives of our community's greatest asset our children. Become a CASA volunteer today. Be a superhero and be the difference in a child's life.